Hey, what's going on, guys? This is Antonio from To Continue Press Start, and this is the start of the uh, the Knights of the Gaming Round contest that I really uh, played on doing with my friends. To kick this entire series off, we're gonna play Battle Kid Fortress of Peril. For those of you who don't know, this is a homebrew game that was made, um, started in 2008, ended in 2010. The guy who made it is called Silvac, and the guy is awesome and amazing. Um, let me go ahead and break you guys off with the rules of this contest real quick. I'm going to give these guys 10 minutes to play this game. Time is going to start when they get to the first wooded area. You're going to know it when the time, uh, excuse me, you're going to know it when uh, the music changed. They're going to have the ability to hit their save states. They're going to save state in every room, hopefully, if they can remember. And um, the big thing that I'm going to do is we're going to have every movie side by side by side by side. Um, at the end of this, when everybody has got their run, and well, we're going to see who the victor is, nobody else is going to see anybody else's video until this entire thing is up. So it's actually going to be cool. Um, I might actually do some commentary for when um, all four of the guys get together and we actually do this thing. But the first player up right now is my good friend Joe. Um... He's never. He had. I can't lie. He's had a. Little, he's got a little bit of a leg up because he has seen the first little couple bits because he's seen me do it, and we had to make sure that he can test out his controller. I'm gonna give all the other guys the same ordeal. But something else that's gonna be really special about this is you're not gonna hear me give commentary. You're going to hear him give commentary. I'm gonna tell. <laughs> you're gonna hear me in the background. I'm gonna let him know how much time he's got left. I'm gonna let him know when he's got five minutes, two minutes, one minute, or five minutes, three minutes, two minutes, one minutes, and then when his time is up. When his time is up, he has to hit start exactly where he's at, and his time is through. All right. So with that being said, Joe, here we go. Time begin now. Nope, time begins when you start uh, your station. I forgot to mention that everybody's been playing on I'm pretty sure they just heard you. Okay, cool. Yeah. Yeah, let's do this. We get little Ike on the ship now. Oh, 
why? Shit. Yeah, I, I tricked it. Don't do it like that. Oh man, I just thought he's coming. Mighty gay. Yeah, Again, from the, from the top. Why did I do that? Because I'm a fucking moron. Dude, I do not like this shit. Fucking snail! Ain't that the gayest shit? Ah! <laughs> oh, fuck. Come on. 
<laughs> Mulligan. sure it was going to get a lot harder than as far as I got, but it's pretty crazy. You, if it would be, it, aside from the lag, the timing could have been a lot better for a lot of things. Do you think it's pretty anal about time? About timing? Yes. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Because even with the enemy shots, they don't give you very much time in between them before they're shooting again. Um... Damn, dude, I don't think I have anything else to ask you. Is there anything else you, you want to put out? I just want to say, Civic, you are a motherfucking ass <laughs> <laughs> for making this game, but at the same time, I love you for making something so damn challenging and frustrating. Takes me back to Pac-Man. Pac-Man. Oh, God, Pac-Man. I'm going to have to put that in there. Um, let me see real quick. I'm probably have to edit this in between. All right, pimps and players, that was Joe's run with uh, Battle Kid. It was the first indeed run of uh, my nights of the gaming round. We did suffer from a little bit of lag, so I'm going to check into that. If I can find out a way to record um, without as much lag going on throughout the game, I'm definitely going to uh, give Joe a second run because he did lag a lot towards the end. Um, at the beginning, it was kind of meaningless but towards the end it i can understand a couple of deaths caused his his lag but uh hopefully guys we'll get more into it and then um there there are a lot of priceless moments in that that uh i couldn't take out like the part where joe jumped from the, the top and then landed straight onto an enemy that was just priceless okay, fuck you. <laughs> but uh 
<laughs> yeah, guys, that, this is Antonio from To Continue Press Start, and hopefully, um, I'll catch you next time with our next uh, Nights of the Gaming Round. Till then, catch you later.